Horrifying crash, two skydiving planes colliding at 12,000 feet. But even as one of the planes breaks apart, somehow all nine skydivers and two pilots make it to the ground safely. ABC's Alex Perez has more for us from Superior, Wisconsin. Good morning, Alex. Good morning, Lara. This morning, authorities are trying to figure out what exactly went wrong here. Now, this was this was an experienced group of skydivers, but none of them ever imagined they'd be jumping out of a plane to save their own lives. Within seconds, this thrill ride turned terrifying. This group of skydivers in Superior, Wisconsin, just trying to stay alive. This morning, those survivors say there's only one reason they're still living. We were all very, very lucky here. Lucky because all 11 people, nine skydivers and two pilots survived this unbelievable crash. Saturday night, those skydivers were 12,000 feet in the air, seconds away from jumping, when the two Cessna planes they were flying in collided midair. One plane flying over the other, sparking a huge fireball. All of a sudden, uh, there's this really weird noise that uh, it was kind of just like a, a boom. The lead plane's wing breaks off, and as the damaged aircraft began to break into pieces, the skydivers jumped, deploying their parachutes as they fell from the sky. The pilot had just seconds to scramble and find an emergency parachute so that he too could jump to safety. He's got to get his seatbelt off, he's got to get out the door, and then deploy his parachute. And as the trail plane plunged, the skydivers on board also bailed. But the pilot of that aircraft was able to gain control and land safely. We're not totally sure just yet, but um, we think the trail plane probably got in the wash of the lead plane and uh, caused the collision, but we don't know for sure. Very lucky indeed. In fact, no one suffered major injuries, believe it or not, just cuts, scrapes, and a few bruises.